I'm the boys old man and we're just going to do a quick walk around what we call Tiny One which is uh, a dozer we bought back when the drought started in 2018 drought started and uh, the reason we got that was because our maintenance on our banks and waterways hadn't been uh, done for 10 years so we looked at in the middle of the drought how do we keep everyone occupied and the boys busy we looked at smaller tractors that were cost more than the bigger one these are at the end of their mining life and um, so we can still there's still got some hours left in them and so we thought we'd repurpose them to agriculture so we're having a bit of fun doing that um, this one was um, it's it, it was came with new chains and sprockets um, and it's a 6.2 meter blade 770 horsepower um, we use around about 110 litres an hour when we work in them um, of fuel and uh, 250 hour oil change. Um, they've been very good, very productive, and they've served us really well so far. But you know, it's not, if you were to buy a new one, the, the, the model wouldn't work. So there's Tiny One. Tiny Two, because we had Tiny One, we got 22 because we need, We thought they're at the end of their life. Parts are getting harder to get. And we thought we'd have a, a spare parts machine. So this one came with a problem in the engine, was making metal. And we bought it as a spare parts machine. And we did an autopsy on it and found that we could get it running. Uh, it was a broken oil pump in the engine that was making the metal. We fixed that up and we got it working too. So it's been really, uh, productive for us um, and we've just recently done some scab replacements and some uh, segment sprocket segment replacements too it's obviously got the single ripper uh, more for the dedicated um, rock mining um, the multi shank ripper on tiny one is really good in the farming application for the um, earthworks contour banks and waterways that we create or repair so Hence the two of them and the two boys, two of the boys work them together and, they, and they've now, we've now fitted them up with GPS on the blade so that they can do their own cu um, cutting and filling uh, to grade on whatever the application is. We do, a lot of the work we're doing now is just for friends as a contractor and um, it's working really well so far and everyone seems to be really happy. So there you go, that's a rough outline.